My name is Basil and today we're going to study about stars, galaxies and our solar system. This is from a book named Science by DK Publisher. Huge galaxies of gas, dust, stars and even planets. Galaxies come in many shapes. Some are spread out such as our own galaxy others like squish balls and some have no shape at all. So this this galaxy is our Milky Way and it's a diameter about 100,000 light years away. And it's a type called Barrett Sparrow, you know. So, our own galaxy, the Milky Way, is thought to be a very spiral shape, but we cannot see its shape clearly from Earth because we are part of it from our solar system. It appears as a bare streak in the sky with a central bulge of stars from above it would take it will look like a giant whirlpool that takes 200 million years to rotate the gigantic core inverted and x-ray images revel Einstein activity near the gigantic core the galaxy's center is located when the bright white direction hundreds of thousands of stars that cannot be seen visible lights roll around heat it heating them into clouds of gas and dust the core and this is where so we where where we are solar system our solar system is in a minor spiral arm called the Iran arm and this is the side view of the milky way view from the side the milky way will look like two front eggs back to Back to back, the stars in the galaxy are held together by gravity and travel slowly around the galaxy in a heart in a flow orbit. And this is the Amarda, and it's a type called Spiral. And this is in from the distance of two, tri two tr trillion for t five fifty thousand light years away from us, our closest large galaxy. The Amarna, essentially used around it by a flat, remote disk of stars, gas, and dust, can sometimes be seen from Earth with a naked eye. In 4.5 billion years, Amarna is expected to collide with the Milky Way, forming one huge and central galaxy. And overlapping for 4.5 billion years, that gal our galaxy will crash into Amar the Amara galaxy will crash into our galaxy, making the most huge galaxy in the world. And this is from the Carvedo galaxy. It's from the darkness. And it's also type a ring, a red color, and it's distance from 500 million light years away from us. The Carvedo galaxy started out as a spiral, however. 200 million years ago, it collided with a smaller galaxy, causing a powerful shock throughout the galaxy, which tossed lots of gas and dust to the outside, creating its unusual shape. And this is the Measure 87. It has a lot. It's really bright. And it's type elliptical, and it's distance between 53 million light years away from us. The MP7. Known as the Vicro A, is one of the largest galaxies in our part of the universe. The galaxy is giving out the powerful jet of material from a supermassive black hole. It will become a black hole, swallowing every light there is. At its center, electric enough to electric particles to nearby the speed of light. This, this galaxy is traveling really fast at the speed of light or the speed of sound. They actually live galaxies, and this one is type of American spirals. Oh, and it's from the distance between 45 million or 65 million light years away from us, around 1.2 billion years ago. The antenna galaxies were two separated galaxies, one buried spiral and one spiral. They started to merge a few hundred million years ago when the antenna formed and are expecting to become one galaxy. In about 400 million years, a lot. And this is the small Magellan cloud. It is like where the stars were born. Type dwarf. This is type of a dwarf Magellan. 
and this may be too hard for me to do. Distance from one hundred trillion nine seven trillion layers away from us. This the dark galaxy MC stretches seven thousand layers across, like its neighbor, the large medical cloud LMC. It sh its shape has been destroyed by the gravity of our own galaxy the dark closer to the Milky Way. A bit close to the Milky Way, what is known as the satellite galaxy because it orbits our own. And this is the Whirlpool Galaxies. And it's a type of a cold colliding spiral and dark galaxy. Pretty cool, huh? This image takes me to be 25 million light years away from us. And I'll talk about it. So about 300 million years ago, the spiral Whirlpool galaxy was struck by a dwarf galaxy which now appears to dangle from one of its spiral arms. The colliding structure of gas clouds triggering a burst of a star formation, which can be seen from Earth with a small telescope. Achieve galaxies, including making the black hole. Some galaxies send out bright jets of light and particles from the center. These achieve galaxies can be grouped into four types, radio galaxies, surface galaxies, closer and blasters. All are those to have a supermassive black hole in their core, making really, really super hot. That you will, that you can die in space for like one second. So, known as the galactic nuclei, which turn out the jets of material, too strong, and this is these two strong jets spread out of the supermassive black hole, making the supermassive black hole of a supernova. The material near the center of a supermassive black hole is called an internal disk. An aqua disk of dust and gas scatters around it. And the jets have too much, so much energy, they move it at nearly the speed of light. So much energy, they're going like a Tesla. These are the galaxies. I hope you enjoyed the video learning about stars, galaxies, and our solar system. Please share down on the comments, like, and subscribe. Click the bell icon to get updated on my new videos. Thank you all.